What's up, people? So, um, this is gonna be the second reaction video. I'm gonna be doing reactions a lot on this channel. Well, I'm gonna start doing reactions because I just feel like it'll be good to, like, see, start doing reactions mostly because they are fun, but also because if the YouTuber I'm reacting to sees that I reacted to them, it shows how much love and support I am giving to them and it shows them how much I support them and what they do so that's why I really enjoy well that's why I'm gonna start doing reaction videos one because it's fun and two because when the YouTuber that sees that reaction, sees that I reacted to one of their videos, and that's make no sense, but, um, yeah, um, once they see the video of me reacting to them, it'll show them that I'm, I'm uh, loyal and supportive fan of them. So, yeah, um, this is Anna Campbell. Shout out to Anna Campbell because she is probably my number one favorite YouTuber now. And, um, I, yeah, follow her on Twitter. So, if you see this, Anna, I am going to be, um, tagging you on Twitter. But, yeah, let's get started, shall we? <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is Anna and welcome back to my channel. How is your Wednesday going? I hope it's going great. Wait, so the other day I was I completely forgot. This react the video I'm reacting to is Anna Campbell, I was a crazy kid. And I have a lot of crazy kid stories because I've kind of been a very bad kid my whole life so yeah so yeah let's continue my cousins about how i was like the biggest idiot out of all my cousins that i have literally like over 100 cousins swear to god so i figured why not make a video and talk about some of the stupid things i did as a kid well for starters when i was seven or six or whatever i was in kindergarten so i don't know how old you are like six five whatever i was jumping out of bed even though everybody told us not to do it we kept doing it and i was jumping literally so that was the I was thing like don't jump on beds kids I the bed, hit my head off the glass table split my head open and you go to the emergency room Ow. and get along the same lines of that Ow. two years that after to... that we had this ac like in my old house like apartment building whatever it was an apartment building it was small but there was like an ac that like stuck out of like underneath the window it was like really i like, know exactly what she is talking so about the window. that makes sense because i live in the oh, no. floor, but the building was like really high my parents would always tell me oh, not to no. climb on it and i would never listen so after a long time of not listening i was climbing up it i don't ever listen now i've never listened i still have the scar today what else did I do? Oh, I got in trouble in fourth grade because I thought it was acceptable to take a girl's head, pick it up, slam it into a water fountain, <laughs> and flirting with my fourth grade boyfriend. Yeah, I've oh, pretty God. much always been insane. Oh, this is a good one. I don't Same. know what grade this was in, but it was in elementary school, and it was before fifth grade, so it must have been like third or fourth grade. So I went to Catholic school, if you didn't know, surprise, surprise. And we had a Halloween parade, and... Oh no, I think I've heard it talk about this. While everybody else was wearing costumes such as angels and M&Ms and fairies, I was a devil. Yes, I was a devil at a Catholic school, and not only was I a devil, I was a sexy devil. This costume was a mini skirt. It was like the sexiest costume you could get in the kids section. Like, I've always wanted to be a slut on Halloween. I think I just broke my phone. I got sent home at that parade. Good job, Anna. Good I don't job. know if it was because it was a devil Good or job. if it was too sexy. Probably both. What else? What else? Oh, this is another story involving Halloween. Yeah, it, it, it was, was probably both. It was just crazy and funny. Have you ever trick or treating? That was like Catholic skulls don't go together. Home, but there's a bowl of candy right there. I would do this all the time. I would look around, make sure nobody's around me. Take the entire fucking bowl and empty it into my pillowcase. Yes, people, I went trick or treating with pillowcases because where I'm from in some rural, like it was like fucking trick or treating central. Like there was like, the cotton candy guy and there was like the toy house and we just went 
like up and down like eight blocks and we were loaded oh with candy God. for a long fucking time. Maybe I was so loaded with candy because I stole everybody's candy through the bowls. Can you think of anything crazy? Sounds like something I do. It's actually a good one, the stair story. So like I said, I lived in an apartment complex my entire life pretty much. And we lived in the fourth floor and I would always have my cousins and my friends over and we would take huge sleds. We drove our neighbors nuts. We would take the sleds and drive them down the flight of stairs and <laughs> smash into the fucking wall and the entire apartment would shake oh, and man. all the neighbors would be like, what the fuck That sounds like doing something we I do. Crazy. My cousins put her head open once doing that, like we would get crazy, we would jump on oh, the staircase and we would make God. these jackass videos where we did stunts in the apartment building. We got crazy. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave in the comments something you did crazy as a two kid. Two thumbs up and a two thumbs crazy up. Crazy kid moments because that's what a kid is. You gotta be crazy. You don't necessarily have to be a crazy kid. I've like, always been a crazy a kid. Life. And make sure you subscribe because I do new videos every Sunday. And I still am crazy. So fucking much, and I will see you guys Sunday. Bye. So I hope y'all enjoyed this reaction video. I'll leave the link to the video down in the description. Go subscribe to Anna Campbell because she is an absolute beast and she's an amazing YouTuber. So yeah, peace out y'all.